everybody. Happy Tuesday. So before I start talking about this week, I just want to say that I'm really excited because I found a place to live in Vancouver. I don't even know if I mentioned this before, but I'm going to Vancouver at the end of the summer. Probably in like two weeks or three weeks. Two, two and a half weeks or something. For school, university. But yeah, I found a place on Sunday. I looked at it on Saturday. I found out I got it on Sunday, so I'm really excited because I have a place to live, which is always good. Let's talk about someone who's had a huge impact on their lives. And it's been really hard for me to put words to this. <laughs> I don't know who to talk about. For me, I feel like everyone, maybe not everyone, but most people I interact with on a regular basis, and sometimes even just like one interaction can do it, but like has an impact on me. I just feel like because I feel that way, because everyone affects me to me, <laughs> then it's hard for me to just talk about one particular person when the way I am is a result of like a lot of different people. And I just, I can't decide who has had like the biggest impact. So I just like, I really, I don't really know who to talk about. The battery's dying, so I have to make this a bit quick, I guess. I'm gonna talk more about like a group of people. I hope that's okay, not just one person. And I'm gonna talk about, I think I've probably actually talked about it on this channel before, but this is just what I could think of for this. My camp that I went to, summer camp, that I attended for many years. And all the people there, I feel like they have probably had the biggest impact on me, like camp and the people who have been at camp. I don't even know like particular ones. Well like, okay, there's a few that I can think of actual things that have affected me, but just overall in general, the whole atmosphere at camp that the staff always created. Um, when I was a camper, before I even worked there, I was, I don't know how young I was, but I went there and I used to be incredibly shy. and. Just like the combination of everyone at camp and how welcoming they are and how like they just kind of encourage you to be yourself and not be worried about like real world kind of things like you are at school and stuff like that. And so just like all the camp staff teams that have happened and not just the staff teams, um, fellow campers or when I was a staff, the campers and other staff members. Um, I feel like they've just had the biggest impact on my life just because like I was I came out of my shell at camp. I'm a lot more outgoing because of camp, I know that. I probably wouldn't have had dreadlocks because the reason I got dreadlocks well originally was um, one of the senior counselors, she was like my favorite one of my favorite counselors, she had dreadlocks and I was like, oh my goodness, those look so amazing. I kinda want them and then like half a year later, whatever it was, I think it was like eight months actually, I got dreadlocks. And so dreadlocks, having dreadlocks changed how I acted because I was just more confident because I was like, I have rockin' hair. Yeah. So that's my thing. Like I don't have one particular person that I wanted to talk about that has made a huge impact on my life, but just everyone at the camp that I worked at really has impacted had had like a huge impact on my life. Like them as a collective, that's probably one of the biggest impacting things I've, I've had. So that is it. Sorry for this rambly video. Um, <laughs> well, I don't know if it was actually that rambly. It seemed rambly to me. Anyways, um, bye.